same time. At the same time. There we go. Hey, what's up, guys? We're going live right now. It's me, Jay, from the San Diego Cannabis Farmer's Market. I'm here with Matthew Sink Angel. Sink sorry Angel. about that. And uh, we got. Oh, sorry. Go ahead. Yeah, no problem. We're here. We're going to be talking about the uh, new mixer that's coming up, right? Yeah, we have a job fair and a cannabis business mixer coming up on January 5th. That's a Saturday. When we're going to have some keynote speakers. One of the keynote speakers is Matthew. And we brought him in today to our back cave to do a live feed and basically get some questions out there. If you guys have any questions about the job mixer or, or the, the business uh, mixer, go ahead and chime in. Ask Matthew. He's an open book, yeah. as most of you know. Yeah, so... Um... So for me, the thing that I'll be talking about is pests and pathogens in cannabis. Um, and I recently had a document come out where I, I went over all the different organisms, the bacteria and viruses and water molds and all sorts of things like that. Um, but there's other people who are going to be speaking there too. Who else is going to be speaking? We have a number of keynote speakers. We have more on the way. Um, right now we have Matthew. He's going to be speaking about, uh, like he was saying, pathogens and pests. Uh, we have um, Rich Richard from Palomar. Uh, he's going to be over there speaking as well. Uh, he, uh, he has a wealth of knowledge about growing. He's a head cultivator over there. Uh, we also have Christine Fallen. She's a community college uh, instructor. She's going to be speaking about ed cannabis education and how it's going to invigorate your growth in the new cannabis industry coming up. Michael Boris is going to be talking also. He's going to be hosting them. Um, he's also going to be speaking about cannabis, uh, being a cannabis, uh, educator and also being, um, somebody who's involved in cannabis entertainment, acting, comedy or whatnot. He's a host of several different shows. So we're going to talk about who are some of the sponsors were too, right? We have a couple. Yeah, definitely. We, uh, shout out to our sponsors. Main sponsors is CBD Axis. Thank you for all you do. They're going to be out there. They're going to be hiring several positions. Uh, there's also a licensed uh, company called California Dab Company. They're going to be out there uh, sponsoring as well. Um, we also have Green Flower Media. They're a media company. They're going to be also starting an educational uh, chorus, and it's an online chorus, and it's really good. They're going to be blowing up pretty soon here. Definitely check them out. Uh, Green Flower Media, appreciate all you do. Thank you to all our sponsors as well. Very cool, very cool. Starts at 12 o'clock. Uh, we suggest to come a little bit early. There's going to be a, a rush in the very beginning. So come prepared. Come at before 12, but it does start at 12, and it's going to go all the way till 4. Saturday, January 5th, we figure start the new year off right, learn about the industry, get the community together to meet the, the owners of several dispensaries and uh, try to get a new job. Um, there's going to be plenty of career opportunities there. There's going to be plenty of companies hiring inside the cannabis industry the hemp industry, the CBD industry, they're all going to be there. Uh, we appreciate it. Uh, we're doing this for the, the community, and we're also doing this to empower the, the local industry. Um, we want to support everybody, so make sure to come on down. If you're even interested in what the cannabis industry looks like or the hemp industry or CBD, uh, we want you to come out and check it out and talk to some people. Uh, if it's not even about a career or if you're an entrepreneur that wants to get into something new, it's definitely going to be the day to come check it out. Let's talk about a little bit about what you're going to be talking uh, about that day. Sure. If you don't mind, Matthew. So like I said before, I'll be talking about uh, pests and pathogens. People who are on my feed definitely know me for that. Um, but uh, I recently made a document where I um, collated a whole bunch of academic research on the known cannabis pests and pathogens, which most of which aren't really specialists on cannabis crops. So for people who are interested in cultivation of cannabis and cultivation of plants in general and want to understand what some of those pests are and some of those disease pathogens are, um, then, they want to, then they're going to want to attend my speaking engagement because they're going to learn all about that sort of stuff. I have a YouTube channel, which people on my feed are probably very familiar with at this point, um, where I talk about pests and pathogens and people can, it's all free information. A lot, you know, the vast majority of it is uh, academically uh, sourced research uh, when, where it's possible anyways. 
So um, anyone who ever wanted to find anything out or if they're a cultivator and they're like, what is this problem? How do I fix it? Mm -hmm. You know, um, for a lot of people, they just don't have access to that information, unfortunately. And um, that's part of strengthening the community. It's just giving people access to this info, which is either technical or it's expensive to access or it's guarded information people maybe don't want to talk about. So giving people the ability to have that information for their own home grow or for a commercial grow if they want to get into that and get a head start. That's what that's there for. People are asking me to share my YouTube channel on on my live feed if I direct my attention here. So um, yeah, it's Zenthanol, Z-N-T-H-A-N-O-L. Um, why don't you, while I type, well, I'm about to type this, I suppose. We're still kind of figuring out the um, sort of the physics of Instagram as we do this. January 5th, 2019, it's a Saturday. San Diego Cannabis Hemp Job Fair and Business Mixer. And uh, well, it was, it's from 12 to 4. Right? Starts at 12, ends at 4 o'clock. But you want to get there a little bit earlier because it'll, it'll be a big rush. Definitely. There's going to be some food trucks there. We're going to have some refreshments, um, about three different areas to come check us out. And there's going to be a lot of opportunity that day. I think that's it, guys. We're going to sign off, all right? Cool. All right. Hope everyone has a good one.